So I've had a few requests to uh, do a quick undoing, or actually a bit of an action video on this uh, Milwaukee Fuel M12 CHI, ICIW 12. That's a half inch drive, impact wrench, um, compact little unit, running on the 4 amp hour M12 battery on this one, which is fully charged. I'll just put it off the charging dock and uh, let's see if she'll undo more. There you go, that was on uh, full power mode. Uh, they haven't been off for probably around 10,000 k's and the poor vehicle doesn't get driven much, so probably three months, four months. As you see, zips them off without any real headaches. Now, that's slow and controllable. You can actually ease them back on. With a rattle gun. Obviously you always check them before you uh, drive the vehicle. It's probably not something a professional would do to a customer's vehicle. Um, but for me at home, on my own vehicle, I see no reason why not. As long as you... Uh, see, you, you notice straight away that it's doing up. See how it's, it's not cross-threading, misaligning, whatever. No different to getting it in there and doing it with your fingers. The problem with these Ford Falcon wheels is uh, they run a massive negative offset. Sorry, positive offset. And, um, yeah, they cause issues with the depth of the nuts you can see the depth of the hub in there there you go Milwaukee fuel 12 volt so it's m12 CRW 12 it's meant to have 160 Newton meters I personally chose the friction ring model not the pin detent friction ring is my preference pin detent you've actually got to physically get something in that hole Pop it off. And that's not going to fall off or anything while you're using it. Maybe while you're impacting and pulling away, but look, your sockets get sloppy after a while anyway because you put that much pressure on them. As you can see, do a fully charge. You can easily do the whole car on and off, no worries with this. Thanks for watching. Test for the uh, Milwaukee. I'll tag this in the end of the other video for you. Um, these studs, they're reverse thread. They're on my truck, so they're a stud, and then they're a nut and a stud, and then they have an outside nut. So they are that way. Got it. With a non impact socket, too, mind you. Might forget the big one out for him.
go get the big one. Be back in a minute. Righto, got his big brother out. The 18 CHI WP. Hopefully it doesn't blow the socket to pieces. We might just try it on. Number one first. Go the other way, try and crack. This rattle gun is amazing. Right, little one can't feel bad about that. That wasn't really its fault. They were excessively tight. As you can see, they're much bigger than a vehicle wheel stud. Because they hold jewelies on. Yeah, there you go. It's a serious little unit. It's a serious big unit. Thanks for watching.